Welcome to Toronto Maple Leafs News Now. If you're a passionate Leafs fan, make sure to subscribe to our channel for the latest updates and exclusive insights. Today, we're diving into the recent preseason showdown between the Toronto Maple Leafs and the Ottawa Senators, highlighting key performances and what they mean for the team's future. In their second preseason game, the Maple Leafs faced off against the Ottawa Senators in a contest that was a stark contrast to their first, more offensively driven meeting. This time, the game focused heavily on defensive strategies, with the Leafs fielding a lineup primarily composed of Toronto Marlies hopefuls. Only a few regular Leafs players made the trip to Canada's capital. The result was a closely contested 2-1 loss for the Leafs, but the effort and determination shown by the players were clear. Many on the ice were battling for a coveted spot on the main roster or looking to secure their place with the Marlies, determined to make a strong impression on the coaching staff and management. Item 1. Alex Steve's Opportunistic Goal Alex Steve sees his moment early in the game, scoring the Leafs' only goal at 6.29 of the first period. In a chaotic scramble following a face-off in the center zone, Steve's managed to grab the puck and slide it past Ottawa's goalie Anton Forsberg. Beyond scoring, Steve showcases physicality with eight hits, the most on the team, demonstrating his willingness to play tough and make an impact. His combination of offensive skill and physical play could boost his chances of making the Maple Leafs roster. Item 2. Pontus Holmberg's Detailed Dominance Pontus Holmberg may not have scored, but his performance was impactful, leading all forwards with a 96.72% expected goals percentage at 5-on-5. Five five. Holmberg's line was not scored against, and the Leafs outshot the Senators 6-0 when he was on the ice. His discipline, two-way play contributed to four scoring chances, while allowing none, highlighting his defensive awareness and ability to generate offense. Item 3. Dakota Mermis Quiet Highlight Defenseman Dakota Mermis, signed in the offseason, was a standout on the blue line. Leading the team with over 21 minutes of ice time, Mermis showed he could handle heavy usage while maintaining a steady presence. His smart positioning and calm puck handling helped keep the defensive zone clear and transition the puck effectively, suggesting he could be a reliable depth option for the Leafs. Item 4. Anthony Stalars's controlled goalkeeping. In goal, Anthony Stalars was solid, stopping 15 of 16 shots with a .938 save percentage. His calm demeanor and excellent positioning prevented second chance opportunities, keeping the game tight. Competing with Joseph Wall for the backup goalie spot, Stalars' performance might give him an edge, especially with his imposing 6 feet 6 inches frame. Item 5. Dennis Hildebai's Athletic Backup Dennis Hildebai came in for Stalars and impressed by stopping 10 of 11 shots. His standout save against Brady Kachuk showcases agility and quick reflexes. Hildebai's performance solidifies his status as a top goaltending prospect and while he's likely to start with the Marlies, his potential for NHL appearances is evident. Item 6. Nicholas Madden's Costly Mistake Nicholas Madden had a challenging outing, making a crucial error that led to the Senator's game-winning goal. Under pressure, Madden's weak pass was intercepted, leading to a quick goal. This mistake highlights the importance of composure, a vital trait for young defensemen and could impact his chances of securing a roster spot. What's next for the Maple Leafs? The Maple Leafs are set to face the Montreal Canadiens in another back-to-back -back series, starting in Toronto. The question remains whether head coach Craig Berube will continue to field his main players at home and younger prospects on the road. As the preseason progresses, these roster battles intensify, and the upcoming games will provide more clarity on who will make the regular season lineup. What do you think about the Leafs' preseason performances and the players vying for roster spots? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to Toronto Maple Leafs News Now for more exciting updates.